What's up, Nick? I'm here to educate you again on how stupid you are. See, I haven't seen all your little friends talk shit. And see, the difference between me and you, like I said, is very clear. If you fail at YouTube, you ain't got nothing. I fail at YouTube. I have several things that I can turn to and do as a career, as a job. And I can list almost every single one of them very easily. Music, website creation, merch designing, sound engineer designing for cinematic films and shit like that. Uh, let's see what else can I do. Welding. Uh, doing mechanic work for car stuff, if need be. See, see, I have shit that I can do. Oh yeah, and also, game development. Artwork. So I have all kinds of shit that I can turn to, boy. But if you fail, you got nothing. If I fail, I have several things that I can turn to. Because see, the reason why I know you're going to fail at life, Marty, is because of this one simple thing. You never once took the time to learn a trade or a skill that might come in handy one day. But me, motherfucker... I was making websites before I ever started music. I was creating social websites for my friends to hang out on way back in my early years of high school. Far before I ever stepped foot into the music industry or the music scene. But yet, you choose to be lazy as fuck and not want to learn anything. So if I need to, I can take several of my current skills and combine them with other skills to be successful. Which is why I am telling you this right here and now. You are a lazy, fat piece of shit. You are a lazy, bum-ass son of a bitch. You don't have any skills. You don't have any life skills. You don't have any traits that you can fall back on. Me, I have several things I can fall back on, motherfucker. And guess what? I have every single one of them already in place just in case this shit don't pan out. I've already got motherfuckers lined up for every single fucking thing that I'm able to do. You, you ain't got fucking jack shit. You're a lazy bum who makes videos on other people and makes videos attacking people and you make money off of their backs because you're lazy as fuck. You're lazy and you don't want to work. You've never held a day job in your life. You've never worked for anything in your fucking life. Therefore, no one in the real world is going to respect you. Your business ethics are trash. Your word, garbage. Your attitude, <laughs> your attitude is the worst fucking thing about you. Because you think that you're better than everybody, but really you're just a fucking faggot ass piece of fucking human garbage. You think that it's funny to make money off the backs of people like me. You think it's cute and funny to target and isolate and use and abuse and terrorize other people. But it's not. Like I told you on your stream the other night, Nick. You need to either get the fuck off of YouTube, or I'm going to make you get off of YouTube. If YouTube don't do anything about it themselves, then I will. 
and I'll make them, I will personally force them to get you off. Because guess what? I have that kind of power. I have that kind of power to do it if need be. Not that I need it right now because things are looking really good in my favor right now. But YouTube also knows that if they don't do what I say, then they are going to get hauled in the court and they will be sued. So Nick, if I was you, I'd get a day job because you ain't cut out for this shit, boy. You ain't cut out for social media. You ain't cut out for business. You're cut from a bitch cloth. I'm cut from the cloth of a real ass man that knows how to work his ass off, that knows his fucking work, and that don't take shit from fat little fucking slobby ass pigs like you that want to feel like you're a badass. But really, you're a softest strong in toilet paper. You're weak as fuck. And quite honestly, your health is fucking garbage. So if I was you, I'd sit the fuck down, I'd shut the fuck up, and I'd reevaluate my life. Because right now, your life ain't going nowhere, motherfucker. Your life ain't going nowhere fast. Except down the fucking drain if you don't get your shit together. And stop acting like a stupid little faggot ass bitch. And maybe if you actually got off of social media and actually got a job, you might find that there's more to life than just bullying people. But if you want to continue to do that, well, guess what? I'm going to be the motherfucker that forces you to stop. Because little bitch faggots like you don't deserve to be on this platform. Little motherfuckers like you that bully people don't deserve to have a leg to stand on. And I'm, I'm going to make sure that you and your little friends are gone. And I'm going to make sure the troll community gets shut down. Entirely. Because the little motherfuckers like your little cult, your little terrorist group, are nothing more than a bunch of faggot ass weakling bitches talking shit on the internet bullying people like I said I don't give a fuck what lies people say about me I don't give a fuck about that But I'm not going to sit here and let some fat fucking slob on the internet that thinks he's a badass get away with doing wrong shit to people. Right is right and wrong is wrong. I'm old school, motherfucker. I don't follow these new school rules. These new school rules of social media are a fucking joke. Right is right and wrong is wrong. You bullying people is wrong. And you need to pay for what you've done. So, Nick, good fucking luck in life. Because eventually, eventually you're going to fail. And you're going to be fucked. 